Hello, my little slug family. All right, I am back with your daily readings. You guys, that full moon was a powerful one, wasn't it? Oh my goodness. So we're still in the um, energy of it a little bit, you know, after the full moon, about three days after you can still um, kind of set your intentions. And I hope you guys checked out the uh, full moon intention um, readings, okay? And if you don't know how to set your intentions, go to our full moon playlist and there you'll be able to see the instructions for doing that. You know, I, I do that, um, I've been doing that a, a, a lot lately for the full moon and the new moon. And what I do is I incorporate that into uh, my prayers. And I'll just, you know, keeping a running list of what I'm asking God to help me with and uh, assist me with. And I, I'm telling you, uh, God manifests it for me. Um, he allows the universe to make it come to pass, everything I'm asking. So make sure you take this seriously and um, watch your life begin to change. Okay? All right, you guys, this is your daily reading. I'm going to go ahead and, and mark it for the 16th through the 19th, even though we know that we're past the 16th. But we're going to go ahead and try to pick up the energies from yesterday to it's going to last us all the way through Monday, okay? And if you're watching this and it's past um, the dates of 16th through the 19th of August, just know Spirit has led you here and this reading will apply to you, okay? You can apply it to your sun, your moon, your rising, and for some, even your Venus sign. Hello to our cross watchers out there, <laughs> okay? You guys don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Hit that little bell right next to it, and uh, you'll be notified every time we release a reading. Don't forget to follow us on Instagram at Lotus Love Carol 555. All right, my loves, let's get right into it. This is the reading for fire signs, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo, for the date of August 16th through the 19th. Holy Spirit, divine, create the universe with messages. Need to go forth for our fire signs, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo, for the date of August 16th through the 19th. What messages need to go for for our fire signs? Okay, we're going to go ahead and take this one because this wants to make a debut. Okay. Holy Spirit, divine, create the universe. What messages need to go for for our fire signs? Aries, Sagittarius, Leo, <clears throat> for all the 16th to the 19th. What messages need to go for for our fire signs? August 16th through the 19th. Okay, I've got two more that are flipping. Okay, you guys. Let's keep it moving. Holy Spirit, divine creator of the universe, what messages need to go for? For our fire signs, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo, for the date of August 16th through the 19th. What messages need to go for? Wow. Okay, you guys. Cards are coming out fast. <clears throat> okay. Holy Spirit, the God created the universe of messages need to go forth for our fire sign. Aries, Sagittarius, Leo for the date of August 16th through the 19th. What message? My goodness, you guys. All right, let's see what's going on in love. In love. For our fire signs, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo, Holy Spirit, Divine Creator, the universe, what messages need to go forth for our fire signs, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo, for August 16th through the 19th. In love, in love. Okay, those want to come out. We're going to let the, y'all have a lot of messages. You have a lot of messages. Okay, here we go. Let's see what's going on. Make a commitment. Okay, fire signs. So for those that are in a situation, this could deal with a relationship. It could deal with you making a commitment to go back to school, make a commitment to start looking for a new home, make a commitment looking for a new job, new car. Um, or like I said, it could be a relationship, finally making a commitment in the relationship. Spirit says, don't stop. And this is up to you. Okay? <laughs> so don't stop. Okay? So for those that are on their way to making a commitment and maybe you stop, Spirit is clearly saying, don't stop. And this is, this is up to you. 
This is up to you, which means that spirit is giving you a choice, you know, for you to decide which route you're going to, you're going to take in this, but stay optimistic. Your dreams are coming true. So don't quit right before the miracle occurs. Wow. You got two cards dealing with not stopping. Okay. From two different decks. Break free. Try different ventures and experiences as a way of grow, to grow and learn. So you're breaking free from something or someone, okay, that is holding you down. You could be breaking free from somebody that is not good for you, not serving your highest good, and spirit is saying make a commitment. So some of you may have thought about leaving someone so your life could be better, and you stopped. And spirit is saying don't stop. Yes, this is up to you, but you need to break free from this person and make a commitment to maybe leaving, make a commitment to yourself or make a commitment to someone else and consult an expert. More information is needed. Contact someone with expertise in this area. This could be a friend that uh, has uh, wisdom, a family member, mother, father that has wisdom to, to, um, to give to you on this matter. Okay, or it could actually be an expert that you need to see, especially those that are, that are trying to make a commitment as far as a career, job, what have you. Maybe you need to consult someone. If you're trying to go back to school, maybe you need to consult someone. If it's dealing with your health, maybe you need to consult a doctor, vegetarian. A new way of eating gives you more energy, greater health, clarity, and stronger manifestation abilities. I feel like some of you during this full moon are really trying to make an effort in deciding to eat right. Okay, you understand how important food is on a daily basis. And sometimes if you just change that lifestyle just a little bit, you'd be surprised how the weight will start shedding, your mind will become clear, so on and so forth. But that takes preparation. And for some of you, that may be what make a commitment is about. Maybe Spirit is saying make a commitment to the lifestyle change. Make a commitment to eating right. Okay, don't stop what you're doing, but that's up to you. And you need to stay optimistic and break free from eating junk foods, you know, foods that aren't good for you. Consult an expert on maybe a dietary plan. This could very well be uh, for some of you. Okay? And deception. Someone is wearing a false self mask in this relationship. This does not always mean someone is, is having an affair, but it could. It could very well mean that. Sometimes, sometimes this means somebody's not being their true authentic self. Somebody's not telling you how they truly feel in a situation. They're just giving you what you want to hear. But it could, could truly mean that somebody is having an affair. Somebody is stepping out. You have to realize and understand what resonates with you. But somebody is not giving you their true self. Or it could be you. Fire signs. Flirt. Extend your lighthearted energy to others. I'm feeling like in this situation for where this person is not giving their true self, sometimes if you go to like a, a playful state, let me, let me explain what I mean when I say that. Playful state, whereas you, you create a lighthearted situation, whereas somebody can feel comfortable with you. Maybe a trip out to a park or a lake or going to the movies. You're creating a very light atmosphere, whereas somebody will give to you their true self. Maybe deception deception will come up or you'll be able to understand and talk clearly through why this is taking place. Because this could be the one. Even though it might be deception right now, even though they may not be showing you their true self. Or this could be you not showing your partner your true self. The person that you're doing this to, this could be the one. You've already met the romantic partner you see. Okay? All right, my loves, if you want to do a private reading, information pertaining to that can be found below. Until next time, bye-bye.